Good morning, everyone. Welcome to a new vlog. Ellie's jumping on the trampoline. Are you jumping? She loves it. I just washed my hair. Um, and me and James are off together, which is a very rare occurrence. So we've decided to have a family day. And it's gonna be really good. It's already been a really good day. Um, yesterday was kind of a horrific day, but we'll talk about that later in the vlog. So let's vlog. Welcome to a new one. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you enjoy it and wanna see more of it. So yeah, I would show James, but he has on no shirt and he's weird about his nipples, so. Your makeup's looking bomb as fuck. Huh? Yeah. Your makeup still looks bomb as fuck. I do want to draw. You can't play in mommy's story bag. Oh my god, that was beyond stressful. <laughs> um, we decided to run to Indiana to a little town that's maybe an hour away from us. Um, James really just wanted to go eat somewhere that we don't have at home. <coughs> Eleanor Lane. And I, I really, 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 really what? like the way Torrid bras fit me. And um, my underwear, underwire popped the other day. Click it or take it, baby. Uh. Um, whew, sorry. So when my underwire popped and was impaling me at work on Sunday, and it's Tuesday, I uh, was gonna order some bras off of the Torrid app. And then today when James was like, why don't we just go uh, up to Indiana? I was like, you know what? Let me Gucci gang, cause I could just go in the Torrid store cause we don't have one in my town. So that's what we did. I got some panties Jeez. and some bras. Gucci gang. Um, I'm wearing this really cute new shirt I got from Shein. And I did something crazy with my makeup. Um, I know I said uh, in the last clip that this week has kind of like really sucked. Um, and it's only Tuesday. It really, really sucked. I had my um, fifth nursing school exam yesterday. And uh, I was short by three points. So I was advised by my instructor to withdraw from the program and reapply. So I'm now I'm no longer in the nursing program. Um, I went ahead and went online and withdrew from the semester. And when I get home tonight, I will reapply. And I think I'm also going to apply to um, a nursing program that's like half an hour away from us just to better my chances. Um, I really needed to, you know, film and do a bunch of stuff yesterday, but after I took that test and I got scored and they emailed me all that, I literally just had a breakdown. Um, and James was at work. He actually had to do inventory yesterday, so he was almost two hours away. And it was just not a good day for me, but I'm trying to focus on the positives. Um, like the positives that I can think of is that maybe in August, if I get readmitted, you know, the classes will be in person and um, in person classes work better for me. Maybe um, I will have perfected my study techniques by August. Um, some of my friends that applied for this semester that got waitlisted, maybe they'll get in and I'll have people that I know and, you know, will be able to work with a lot more will get accepted while I get re-accepted. So I'm trying to think of the positives and then Beebs here is forever the positive one. He was like, think about the shit you're already now to know how to do. Like I only have one checkoff left. So I already know five of the checkoffs, five of the skills, I already have them down, have passed them. So. You must be better prepared for next semester. That's what my entire family is trying to convince me of. I feel like a failure. I feel like I have let Ellie down and myself down and my entire family down, but I'm not a failure. it's going to be fine. Everything happens for a reason. Um, so another positive is I will definitely have more time to film for you guys now. So that'll be good. Cause I've literally sucked the whole year because <laughs> I've been trying to do nursing school. So 
this will give me time to film more and hang out with my baby more and I'm just gonna enjoy the summer and deal with whatever happens uh, whenever it happens so we're in Indiana but I think we're about to head back to Kentucky I know we have to go to the grocery store because we need dog food and milk or something else we needed best time to go to the grocery store is when James is off and with me. <sighs> I guess he can help carry it. I know for sure we need dog food and milk. There was something else. I don't know, but I just wanted to let you guys know what was going on and why uh, I've kind of, I, I haven't been missing my uploads because I've I had to withdraw, I failed out. Um, I've actually just been missing my uploads because after spring break, the first semester of nursing school was like, there's 18 tests, 47 lectures, four clinicals and three simulations left and you have four weeks to do them all and it's just a lot of shit. And obviously I broke, so um, that's why I've been missing my uploads, but if you know me in real life, that's why I've been really, really down for the past day or so. Um, so. But it's all good. It's going to be fine. I'm going to come back stronger and better than ever. And if my local nursing school does not accept me, I'm going to apply to one about half an hour away that actually has a way better pass rate because the nursing program I just left their pass rates like in the low 60s like they really don't have a good pass rate but it's just convenient because it's where I live so we're gonna go probably back to Kentucky and we're probably gonna end up at Walmart because we'll be passing it James is overly enthused yay how about you a Lego set We just got home. I figured I'd show you what all we got. First things first, I got um, some Mother's Day gift wrap from Walmart. Let's just do the Walmart stuff real quick. I also picked up this leather and gold detailed backpack. Uh, are you playing with gift wrap? I mainly bought, oh, I didn't realize it had two. That's cool. I mainly bought this because I want a different work bag. Because I always carry that sunflower one right here. And it's just really big and bulky. So I'm going to try to compartmentalize everything. Yes, yes, yes. We got some Jack's Pizzas. James likes Supreme. I like sausage and pepperoni. I got, I got a notebook for next semester because I'm going to get readmitted. Right, James? Speaking of who is it? What you doing? Putting the trash bag in? Say what? You can take the dog out after you do that. I got a Mother's Day card for my memo. One for my Nana. One for my mom. I still have to get James's mom and grandpa mother under control i bought a pack of g2 pens i normally prefer the paper mate ink joys but the 1.0 worth it 
And then we have a regular dog brush, but our dog has super short hair. So I figured a slicker brush would be better to try to get her loose fur out. That is for James's Father's Day present on the low, low. He'll never know he's taking the dog out. We got Ellie some apple juice boxes. And then, listen, so I work with my, one of my really good friends, Crystal, and my mom. And we've gotten into a habit of always having a coffee. So I got me a Java Monster, the Mean Bean. I got my mom a Mocha Starbucks. No baby. And then Crystal likes Red Bulls. No ma'am. And then James got him a monster. Woo. So I had bought a whole container, or put it in my cart, a whole container of grape tomatoes and Ellie was snacking on them in the store. She had the whole container, so she just got some apple slices. Yeah. Eleanor Lang. Yeah. Um, we got Quaker caramel rice cakes. These are so good. I got two from my house. And then we got my mom a pack. She said she got five of them the other day. What, baby? No, hang on. I picked up some razor blades. Hang on, Ellie. Um, I went ahead and I needed a new Elf Camo CC Cream Foundation. So I went ahead and bought a new one because I'm almost out. James got two new pairs of basketball shorts. This is an exhilarating vlog here. We also got the Quaker kind of rice crisp, like the bag. Shoop. We got three gift bags, three coordinating bows. I thought that'd be cute. I got two sticker books. Ellie got some out of this world magical bath powder for kids in orange creamsicle. And Ellie also got Toy Story pajamas. James got some Reese's in. What are you doing? No. No? Um, no. I'm not picking that up out of the floor. The rest of the Walmart stuff is milk, iced coffees. James got a 12 pack of Monster for work and some liters. I will show you this. Some liters of the caffeine water. It tastes just like regular caffeine, but one bottle, which is one liter, has 120 milligrams of caffeine in it. So from Zara, we didn't get a whole lot. I don't know why they gave me such big bags. My keys are in there. That's all we got. Big ass bag. I got three more pairs of drawers. I got um, the black seamless hipsters. These just looked really cute. These are also hipsters. They're like lacy rosy ones. And then these are high waist. Did not realize they were high. Wow, they really are high waist. You know, it, in store toward like folds her panties like this and have them shoved in the drawers. I didn't realize that these were high-waisted, but they're very high-waisted. They're just Harry Potter panties. Super cute. I got myself a new bra because my underwire snapped on Sunday and started stabbing me in the fucking side. So I just got a plain black bra. And then my friend Crystal has been wanting to try their push-up bras. So I got her a tiny, tiny little push-up bra because she's really skinny. Show. Look how small this is compared to me. I'm just saying. So, there's that. Um, that's pretty much all we got. I'm going to put up all this stuff. We're going to get Ellie and Jammies. We're going to get Daddy and Jammies. And then I'm going to reapply to the nursing program. So, a lot has gone down. The ceiling fan is clicking really bad. So, I just got home. It's Saturday. The 
17th. Um, I haven't really checked in with you guys that much because it's just been a crazy week. I've really just been working um, a lot and my house is literally wrecked. Sorry about my tank top. But uh, it's Saturday, like I said. I just left a cookout at my dad's house for my Papa Bill's birthday. But on top of that, um, earlier today, I had to go to a memorial service. Um, I have a really big family and one of my cousins, their dad passed away super unexpectedly and he was super young. Um, so I've been gone all day and James has been at work all day. I feel like trash, <laughs> but I just got home. It's 9.30 and I was uh, about to take Lulu out and she's had an accident in her kennel, which is fine because we've been gone and I feel really bad, but she's had an accident. So I'm getting the stuff because I'm about to give her a bath. Um, and once I get her out of the bath, uh, I've got to clean her kennel out. And then I'm going to take a bath and then I'm going to go to bed probably. Um, and if I don't go to bed, I'm just going to work on like some small stuff. Um, I really need to clean my house, but I've decided I'm just going to make it into a cleaning video. And, um, tomorrow my mom's mom, my memo, she's not in good health. She hasn't been in a minute, but, um, she has finally agreed to leave, move in with my mom, which has been needing to be happening. So I'm going to help my mom move my mom all in tomorrow, but let me take the dog out and get her a bath and everything. There's Lulu. I'll check back in with you later. So James is in our room. He got home from work. I got a zit. It hurts. But um, James is in our room hanging up a shelf I bought from my background and I ordered this um, coffin shaped letter board and I just put the letters on it that I know I want, but now I'm going to go through and like straighten them and organize them how I want them um and then I'm gonna get in the shower Ella, Lu <laughs> Lulu got a bath Lulu's kennel got cleaned up I'm slowly starting to clean the house up but I kind of want to save the house cleaning stuff for in the morning um and record it I don't fully understand the cleaning video craze, but I know I like watching cleaning videos. It just like relaxes me and at the same time motivates me. So, you know, I'm just going to work on the lettering on this right now and chill out for a minute. So, oh, and you won't see my whole new filming setup in this video because that is also a separate video. So, there you go. You check in. Dog, I'm tired. <laughs> um, it is the afternoon and I'm actually about to go put on actual pants because right now I have on pajama pants with pajama shorts and then we're gonna clean my house and I don't mean like pick it up and you know get it ready for the week because it is Sunday I mean I want to clean the house I want to wipe everything down I want to vacuum I want to mop I want to sweep I want to catch my laundry up I want to put all the laundry up I just <sighs> my house has been so dirty it's been a really really rough week um just a lot has gone on so I'm gonna go put on a bra and pants and we're gonna clean the house so when we get done cleaning the house I am waiting on my mother to call me because my grandmother is moving in with her today at some time at some point and I'm waiting on her to holler at me for help my hair is doing some weird shit back here so I'm gonna put on pants and start filming a cleaning video I totally forgot to Ooh, sorry I totally forgot to mention that James did get my shelf built and I actually sat down and had, you know, everything set up like I was really gonna film and found where the top of my screen is at and he hung it up for me. So that is always good, but literally my house is a mess. And I think I forgot to tell you guys 
I don't know why my flash is on, but um, we had to get a new bed frame, so we ended up getting box springs because like the low profile bed was not working for me. The only upside to the low bed was that Ellie could jump up and get down and do all her stuff on her own. Um, and I was really worried about having a tall bed again. I mean, it's not as tall as the first bed we had in this house was, but my child, you would think she would just, you know, get on the bench to climb up there. Nope. My sweet little precious Ellie literally just yeets herself. So literally my house is disgusting. There is shit everywhere. So I'm gonna clean. Okay, I don't have time to show you, but um, I actually got pretty far with my cleaning. I got Ellie's room, the small bathroom, and part of my living room. Um, I haven't done floors or anything yet, but I mean, you'll see it in the cleaning video. But I'm on my way to my mom's house right now. My mom just called me, there's a problem. So I did take my hair out of my braids. It's still wet, but I'm running to my car. I'll check back in with you guys later. Hopefully no one ends up in jail. I'm letting, Lu Woo! I'm letting Lulu go pee. Nobody judge me on my terrible dog training skills, so. Come on. I don't know what you're eating, but you don't need to be eating it. <laughs> okay, anywho. I just got back from my memo's house. Um, I'm sure you can tell from my red eyes and puffiness. That did not go well. My mama is a very stubborn lady. Um, everyone in my family is super, super stubborn. So, that just didn't go the way we wanted it to. Um, I just got back home, I'm taking Lulu. I'm in my backyard. I don't think y'all have ever seen the backyard. I'm in my backyard. In all the woods. Uh, Lulu's terrified of the uh, buzzards. She's not really acting crazy back here. I'm just going to let her trip around for a little bit, get out some of her energy, and then I'm going to go back to cleaning to try to calm myself down before I go to get Ellie. And also, I have a giant zit on my chin, cheek area. So that's a fun little update for right now. Lulu, you wrapped yourself around the tree. Come on now, Lulu. Why you do this to your mother? Don't trip me. Lulu, come this way. Come on. I'll check. Wow. <laughs> this day, one, this is getting so much worse, but Ellie's with us. My mount fell off of the windshield, so I'm just free-handing it for the moment. Uh, mommy is pure trash and didn't realize we had no milk, no juice, no nothing. So we are running to the store real quick, and then when we get home, I'm gonna start dinner if I don't just completely give up and pick something up uh, but the plan is I'm gonna cook dinner when we get home and uh, continue cleaning Shaga right Ellie hi. say hi Heidi she's so funny I look insane I just got done popping on some nails and I do not like them <laughs> like from far away they don't look bad but up close they look a little rickety. Sit over here, still going hard. I'm on my laptop for the first time literally in a week because I just haven't wanted to get on here. Um, Cause um, aside from my YouTube stuff, really the only time I'm, I was ever on my laptop was for nursing school, which is depressing. So. You know. I'm finalizing some videos. I have two ready to go. And then I'm going to probably go to bed because I'm tired and it's almost 1 a.m. Um, by the time Ellie and I got home and ate dinner, it was really late. And then James got home. They went to bed. I stayed up. Um, and now I'm just ready to go to bed. I'll see you. 
I know for sure I'll see you in the morning because I have to run to the store. I think I'm taking James' granddad to the store too. And I for sure, for sure have to go get my COVID test. So, it'd be alright. I do want to, I'm pretty sure these are going to get ripped off. I would really enjoy going to get my nails done, but it's not looking likely at the moment. So, it's all good. It's all good in the hood. I will see you guys in the morning. Hello. I know I said I was going to check in with you this morning, but I just didn't feel like being on camera this morning, TBH, and I ripped my nails off before I even got to bed, so... What can you do there? Me and Ellie just got back. We had to go to work and get my COVID test. Um, and then we ran to Kroger and then Ellie fell asleep. So we drove around for a minute. Uh, I'm just, I'm bagging, unbagging, debagging um, the few things I got. I didn't get a ton. This wasn't like a huge shopping trip. It was just re-upping on some stuff, veggies, fruit, mainly. And like some like cereal and shit but i'm gonna unbag it all and then i'll let you see it and then i'm gonna get up out of these jeans and we're gonna continue to clean and do laundry and all that which all the cleaning i did yesterday has been undone by my two-year-old so as soon as she got home she was like you know what these floors mana so what can you do there i stopped at a gas station and got gas chicken gas station chicken hey baby ellie got a bag of fig bars some lucky charms most of this stuff is for ellie's lunches um the kroger brand little i don't know they're tiny they're like 50 cents i always get her these for fast lunches what baby are you hungry yeah mama's about to make stuff so I got her two green beans, two peas, two corn, and two carrot. Then I got her, no, that's not hers. <laughs> I got a can of cream of chicken, a can of diced tomatoes, grape tomatoes, which is Ellie's favorite, grapes, bananas, and then this is super awesome. Um, it's asparagus roasting bag. And it's, I don't even remember what it is. It's like garlic butter or something. I also got Ellie two of these little mashed potato cups. Um, we got milk, we got chicken, we got pop tarts, we got pop pies, orange juice, cookies because I'm trash, and Ellie loves mini muffins in the morning. So I'm gonna get off here really quick and make booger bean something to eat. I love you. Hang on, baby. Look how cute she is today. Oh. No, she's not in the mood. So, I'm going to put all this up and get her lunch. Going. It is very loud in this room. You just going to have to excuse it. Um, you're sitting in a dryer sheet box. No shame in my game. Uh, it is about 10.30 in the morning. Uh, I didn't really check back in with you yesterday because the whole day just went crazy honestly it just went crazy um james's grandfather uh ended up wait let me start from the beginning okay my grandmother that was supposed to be moving in with my mom um and has a ton of health issues she uh, ended up going by ambulance to our local hospital, to our, ho our county hospital, and, um, one second. So she ended up going to the hospital by ambulance, and, um, that's stressful on any family, but my older brother, David, um, he is a paramedic, so it just... The fates of the gods made it to where my brother was the one that had to go pick her up, um, which really, really takes a toll on him. Um, this is the second time he's had to be the one to go pick her up. Um, and, and so she ended up in the hospital. We all got there because we have a whole thing 
when you're in the hospital, you are not by yourself. There's somebody there with you. Um, COVID willing, because now they have a bunch of different rules. But my brother got there with my memo and my grandmother. And me and my mom showed up. And my stepdad was there. And then um, it's just very high stress. Um, we thought maybe she had a stroke. They have ruled out a stroke, which is super good. They admitted her. Uh, my grandmother has COPD and emphysema. Um, so most of the time when she ends up being admitted, it's because her CO2 levels are too high. And once they ruled out a stroke, we figured that's what the problem was. Um, and sadly, one of the easiest ways to fix elevated CO2 is to be put on um, to be intubated, to be put on a ventilator so that you can take a really good deep breath and exhale your CO2. Because um, if you don't know, you inhale oxygen, you release CO2. And um, if you have COPD and emphysema, it's hard for you to take that big deep breath and to release all that CO2. And when you have an elevated CO2 level, it, um, it, it causes a lot of problems. It can cause you to be disoriented. It can cause you to be confused. You can lose consciousness. And it's just not good. So that um, that happened. And me and my stepdad and my sister-in-law were sitting in the waiting room because obviously my brother's at work. He had to go back on the ambulance and we're all just trying to figure out what's going on, what we need to do. My mom's back there with my grandmother and then Ellie was at home with James and James calls me and he was like, Hey, I just got off the phone with your dad. I'm going to have to drop Ellie off. And I'm like, Oh my God, what's wrong? Well, his grandfather had to go to the ER with chest pains. So they admitted both of them. It was just a stressful uh, night all the way around. So st stressful. So right now I'm just folding my clothes so I can switch over my laundry. My laundry has gotten really, really, really backed up. I'm almost caught up though. Um, and then I'm gonna get ready to go to the hospital. I can't uh, go right now because my grandmother is in the ICU and even though it's within their very short visiting hours she had to go for an MRI so we're not allowed to visit now until this afternoon which absolutely sucks um, and hopefully I get to go in and see her before Ellie comes home because I can't take Ellie to the hospital um, but it's looking like probably not gonna be able to so I'm gonna fold this laundry get ready and then, this sounds horrifically insensitive, but I think while I don't have Ellie and just so I can de-stress a little bit, because honest to God, this, this, this week so far sucks. Um, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go get my claws put back on, my nails done. So, I have a couple ideas for them. I might go get that done. And then once Ellie gets home, I plan on just editing, cleaning up the house, doing my wifely duties. Sid's looking vicious over here. Get it, Sid vicious. Um, and I really need to take out my trash. I found a laundry basket in a box I need to get rid of. So I guess that's what I'm gonna do. It's just been like the world's most stressful 24 hours. Always, man. So, Jim's went off to work. He won't be back until about 10 o'clock tonight. And before I found out I wouldn't be allowed to go see my grandmother, my dad had already called because my we didn't end up leaving the hospital until like 1 a.m. So, Ellie was at my dad's and she was obviously already asleep. So... Um, before I knew that I wasn't, wasn't going to be allowed to go back and see my grandmother, my dad had already called and he has Ellie 
run an errands with him for my other grandmother. So I'm gonna get ready. I really need to do a foundation wear test, but there's honestly like four hours of footage I have already that I really need to edit. So it probably, probably would not be smart of me to start a whole new video, so. I mean, I get ready. That's where we're at right now. Stressed as fuck. So, you know, I'll check back in with you guys later. Probably once I have my claws back, if I have time to. Hopefully, I do. So, there you go. It is absolutely fucking hot. Like, hot oh shit. Um, I got ready. I'm leaving the house, obviously, right now. Um. When it gets hot, you know, I have the su suction cup mount in my car. And when it gets hot, you know, the suction cup always releases. And it's been down for like a week. And I hadn't really paid attention to it. And I just went to put it back up. And it is broken. What is that? Mount 15? Perhaps I should stop buying like $5 mounts. But you know. You know. You live. You don't learn. Uh, so right now... I am, I just checked in with my dad. They're still at the appointment with my Nana running errands. My, my mom still can have visitors. So, I'm going to go run and try to get my nails done. I'm very excited. So, yeah. And I guess once I get my nails done, I'll run in to like roses or something and get a, get a little mount. So sick of my mouths breaking but that's really all I'm gonna do today other than just take care of family um, my scheduling lady also sent me like a bajillion hours and I do need to make my schedule out for this week and text her back what I can work but I don't want to like put anything in stone and then something happened and me not be able to work so I don't know. I'll have to talk to my mommy about it, but right now I'm just going to go run and get my nails done. And I'm going to stop recording this spot right now, this little little clip, because my arm is on fire. So, check back with you when my nails are done. I'm picking up Ellie from my dad's house. Oh my god. There's dad. There's what? Nani. Roots. Okay. I mean, the dark roots aren't nearly as bad as the gray. Tell him I was coming to help you up. Oh, I didn't know what to do. Nani wants me to take a picture of you. Handily, there's a feature where I can take a picture while I record a video of you two. Yeah? Well, I mean, Ellie's in the middle. Oh my god. Did y'all want Coco Melon in the background? We don't care. Hi. Ellie! <laughs> <laughs> Ellie, can I get in a picture Let's get a picture. Too? Get a picture with Bobby. Show me your teeth. Show me your teeth. <laughs> oh, you're so pretty. <laughs> oh, wait. Do it again. Oh, do it again. Ready? Ellie, wait. Get a kiss. Oh. Okay. Okay, I'll do We're going to go home since they gave Ellie lunch and let me start to death. <laughs> Bye, baby. I love you bunches. I'll see you tomorrow. What'd you eat? Or TV dinner. It's nothing. What'd you eat for lunch? You washed that coffee cup yet? Do you want to eat the banana? No. No? Nana. They see you with your nana. What a psychopath. Anywho. Um, it is later that night. It's actually 10 o'clock at night. Me and Ellie are about to hit the suck. But, I figure, I'm going to go ahead and get ready. Get my nails done. Because I have to work a 12-hour shift tomorrow. I figured I would show you, uh, since I have to work a 12-hour shift tomorrow, Mommy. what I'm going to pack for lunch. Mommy. Yes. Mommy. Yes. Mommy. Um, the Main thing I get is the Olay Extreme Wellness spinach and herb Mommy. tortillas. Mommy. Um, Mommy. 
And I just used some Mommy. deli turkey and Kobe Jack. Mommy. What, baby? I got it. Mommy. Yes, and I make two wraps. We got some green grapes I just washed. I pack extra because I have one of my best friends works with me, so I never know if she's wanting to eat. Plus, it's 12 hour shift, so I don't really give a fuck. Um, two string cheeses, one caramel rice cake, and these are the best ones. They're the Quaker caramel rice cakes. They make like little rice crisps in a big bag. And the only unhealthy thing I'm really packing is a Java Monster. And then I don't pack water in my lunchbox because I have a 64 ounce water bottle Mommy. that I fill up with water Mommy. and I just carry it everywhere with me. What? I can't see you. Yeah, they can't see you. So I'm just going to put this in the fridge now that it's packed. I'm going to try to put it in the fridge now that it's packed. And in the morning, Mommy. on the way in, Mommy. I'll probably stop Mommy. and get... There you go. They can see you on camera now. Mommy. Mommy. Um, on the way to work uh, tomorrow, I, I might yeah. stop and get uh, a large cup, coffee cup, cup, like iced coffee cup, with some ice in it, and I'll put a Premier uh, Protein shake in it. Caramel uh, uh, Also, this is what my nose ended up looking like. Uh, Not what I wanted. Really, they're all good except for my ring fingers. Um, I'll insert a picture of what the ring finger was supposed to look like. Then we can discuss how shitty those looks. Right? Dad, that's, that's right. That's right. I love you. I love you. I can't take but it. me and Ellie, no. we've already washed our face, brushed our teeth, brushed our hair. I just threw mine into loose piggy pigs. Look at my real hair hanging out. Um, is it pretty? Oh, mommy, mommy, I This is my girl right here. She's my hype man. Um, uh, my mom's mom, my mama, that is in the hospital, she is still intubated. Mommy. They did an MRI this morning. Oh, mommy. Oh, and it came back negative, which means she doesn't have any bleeds, which is good. That's what we want. Um. That was really all that happened today. Um, okay. 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 You're not going to say it? No. No. I don't know. But I think I'm going to stop the vlog here. Um, I have about four hours of footage to edit all the together. Oh, mama. Is it pretty? Oh. Don't fall. Oh. Sid's still um coming in hot, but now Nancy oh. is here too. My, oh. At least they're together. I do feel extra fierce though with my nails back on. If I get back into the nursing program though, I'll have to take these off in August. But until then, I'm planning on keeping them on. I just feel huh? more myself. Mommy! <sighs> Mommy! What? Oh. And um. Mommy. I've had a couple of people because I've been on my Snapchat. Mommy. What? Uh, 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 I've had a couple of people ask what I asked for, and I just asked for <laughs> Coffin Shape, a new set, a full new set of Coffin Shape with matte black. And then I showed a picture of like Beetlejuice stripes for my ring finger that got fucked up. But they're just matte black Coffin Shape nails. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna tickle me? <laughs> so, um, I hope you guys liked the vlog. It was very stressful. <laughs> um, dropped out of nursing school, grandmother in the hospital, grandfather in the hospital. Yeah, it's been a stressful fucking week, so. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, make sure you give it a Mommy. thumbs up. Mommy. Ellie. 
Ooh. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you Ooh. did like it. And I will see you guys all in my next video. I love you. Say goodnight. Goodnight. Blum kiss. Blow it where they can see you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, say bye-bye. Bye-bye. I'll see you guys. I know I just said I was cutting off the vlog and touching you bye and everything, but can you see? It's, don't step outside. It is snowing. It was 70 degrees today. And now it's snowing. Mommy's gonna try to find one of your boggins. Snow. You don't like snow? <laughs> snowing. Daddy's home. Daddy's pulling in. Daddy. Okay, so now I'm really gonna stop vlogging. I hope you guys have a great, luxurious day. Hope your day is going great. And yeah, I really will see you all in the next one now. Bye.